This picture shows the equipment for the third generation of new oxygen bottom blowing lead melting technology. Oxygen bottom blowing electrothermal bottom blowing modern reduction process developed by China Enfi Engineering Corporation. The concentrate bins and the proportioning plant building are used to store raw materials for oxygen bottom blowing smelting and electrothermal bottom blowing reduction furnace smelting. The raw materials required for oxygen bottom blowing SKS smelting will be discharged onto the belt conveyor via the constant feeder at the bottom of the bin and delivered to bottom blowing furnace section of this smelting plant building. The mixed material and smelting dust will be sent to the auxiliary planting building of oxygen bottom blowing SKS furnace for pulverizing by the disc pulverizer. After pulverization, they will be sent to discharge bins respectively by the belt conveyor and the reversible belt conveyor with hopper, then charged into the smelting furnace through the constant feeder and the movable belt conveyor. This is the oxygen bottom blowing smelting furnace. The primary lead building produced by bottom blowing SKS smelting furnace will be cast by the primary lead casting machine after surge ladles. The off gas from SKS melting furnace after cooling via waste heat boiler WHB and dust collection via ESP will be sent to the acid making plant building through high temperature exhauster. The high lead molten slag from oxygen bottom blowing SKS melting furnace will be fed into the actual thermal bottom blowing reduction furnace via chute. When the reduction furnace is in case of failure, the high lead molten slag will be cooled to be cast into the ingot by the bypass slag casting machine. This is the bottom blowing actual thermal molten reduction furnace. The flux and lump reductant used for the actual thermal bottom blowing reduction furnace will be conveyed from two charge bins to charge bins in front of the reduction furnace in the smelting plant building via vibrating feeder and the belt conveyor. Then discharged into the electrothermal bottom blowing reduction furnace by the movable belt conveyor after being measured by the constant feeders. While the off gas from the reduction furnace after cooling via WHB surface cooler and dust collection via back filter will be sent to gas desulfurization system via the exhauster. The lead bullion produced by the reduction furnace will be cast into ingots by the lead bullion casting machine after the surge ladle. The final reduction slug from the electrothermal bottom blowing reduction furnace will be charged into the fuming furnace via the chute. The slug from the fuming furnace will be directly granulated via the chute. The off gas from the furning furnace will go through WHB for cooling down. The surface cooler as well as back filter for recovering zinc oxide dust then being sent to the gas desulfurization system via the exhauster. When the fuming furnace is in case of failure, the final reduction slug will be directly granulated via the bypass chute 